refuse to not be first. Do we do enough? Well, I, I never shut up, up Harry. Uh, must have been about 17, 16, 17. We nicked their guilt wins. Right, the bouncer's guilt wins. This is no good for me. That's the reality. If you want the honest truth, and I see it every day. This is Joe Pugh for IFL TV, proudly sponsored by Everlast. Delighted to be joining them here in the winning dressing room. Mr. Braddon Albrecht, how are you, mate? I'm very good, thank you, mate. Uh, talk to me, you got that win. <laughs> Get the ball rolling again here at your call. First of all, how did you find it all? Uh, yeah, well, well, very well. Um, just stuck to the game plan. Um, well, yeah, we didn't really have much of a game plan, to be honest, because we only got the opponent uh, yesterday. But, um, yeah, just stuck to what I know and, um, yeah, tried to break him down, hit him some heavy shots and that. But, you know, we just we was just learning, learning at this point. Um, so, yeah, no, went well. Tough, durable opponent, obviously. <laughs> Them ones are always hard to get out, especially on short notice when you don't get the opponent with a lot of notice. But good learning rounds, move on to the next one. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's it. That's, that's all we use that for is uh, all learning. Um, and yeah, can't wait, can't wait to get back out now. So I remember talking to Lee and about probably about six weeks ago now, I think it was just going through the you tiny was like, Look, I've got a fake taxi boxer. He was so <laughs> excited, right, about you and I was like, right, this is gonna be some really like funny interviews here. But obviously playing the fake taxi thing, Lee's gonna get you out and you're just happy to be yeah. with him and just push him through now. Oh yeah, yeah, exactly, yeah. Uh, I've seen um the boxers that he's He's worked with, and um, yeah, they've all got bright fruits of futures. So, um, yeah, I'm looking forward to what's coming up. So, but you have got a fake taxi on your shorts, and it is going to be brought up in every interview. <laughs> what is it? So, your uncle is yeah, the fake yeah, taxi yeah, man. He's, yeah, he's he's not the man, but he's the owner. Yeah. Oh, so he isn't like he, the. He's not. He's not John. No. I thought he was John. No, no, oh, no, I've no, been no. told Lee, Lee thinks he's John. No, no, he, his name is John, but he owns the company. Not he, that he's not actually. Oh, I thought he was my hero. No, not, no, no, no. no, no. He, he, he employs John, yeah. Oh, right. Okay, <laughs> so it's John's guy. employer. He's the main guy, yeah, yeah. Right. So he's hopefully you can employ John to come to uh, your <laughs> call and uh, we'll get him working there. <laughs> <laughs> ring girls. Yeah, ring girls, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> you see the Christmas dudes, yeah, yeah. No, back to yourself then, just uh, how many times do you want to get out by the end of the year, mate? Well, hopefully another three. Yeah. So, yeah, we're looking forward to pushing on and um, hopefully now um, we can start getting some, getting some good rounds in and, um, yeah, pushing on. Random, thank you very much for being to IFL TV. Best of luck and hopefully Sweet. see you in the ring soon. Thank you very much, mate. Cheers, mate. Yes. I refuse to not be first. Do we do enough? Well, I, I never, never shut up, Harry. Uh, must have been about 17, 16, 17. We nicked their guilt wins. Right, the bouncer's guilt wins. This is no good for me. That's the reality. If you want the honest truth, and I see it every day.